this is a room tour of room 20, which is this room off the very tiny itty bitty little lift here at the this hotel. <laughs> I'm too tired. I haven't slept in 24 hours. This is the hotel we're at. You have to put your key card in the slot to, and then you come in and you're in this little hallway. The lobby is done very nice and there's a nice little breakfast area downstairs. I'll try to get some footage of that later. But this is it. This is the whole room. This is a family room, so it has this extra bed. But we have no idea where we're going to put our suitcases. <laughs> okay, this is the... Oh, there's no bidet for Ben. Ben wanted a bidet. Okay. There's the bathroom. I like the tile. There's a really nice shower. A really nice shower. And the sink. It's kind of like... It's very like historic retro. Like look at the plumbing fixtures. Those are really cool. But with a modern twist. And then I mean there's some very nice here's the hair dryer. There's some very nice features actually. It's kind of cool colors, the whole black and white with the little peach accents. So this looks like a queen king bed maybe? Yeah. It's not pretty big. It's not okay. And then there's a twin over here and there's a little table. And then, I mean, but these are like serious historic, yeah, Paris windows. There is air conditioning and it is nice and cool in here, which we're very thankful for because it's like 90 something today. There's a big full length mirror. There's a little thing cool. that I put my backpack on and there's two little tables on either side and there's a picture of, I don't know who that is. Anybody know who that is? Somebody famous or something. And then there's a little coffee maker with like pods. We Meg might figure this out because she sometimes likes to drink coffee. I do too. I've been too. And down in this thing, there's a little tiny safe, which you could maybe fit. A dollar in. <laughs> A phone, <laughs> and then Maybe a camera. This room for we get these things in the mini bar included, and they'll restock them for us. And then here, oh, there's a little garbage can there. And here in this closet, which doesn't open all the way because it bumps into the table, but there's some shelves, and there's four hangers. More shelves, some extra bedding, a kettle for our British friends, and three pairs of really nice slippers. So yay. I'll take one. Okay. Yeah, I'll take them. So this is our room at the Hotel Mercure. It's Mercure. in France. Mercure. That's all we know. We're very, yeah. De Leon. Opera Bastille. It's only two o'clock in the afternoon here in Paris, we're gonna go to sleep. but we're going to take showers and go to sleep because we're exhausted and none of us slept on the plane. Like really, we closed our eyes and tried, but we didn't really sleep on the plane. We're here for three nights. Hopefully our trip starts to go better. We had quite a trek getting here. Lots of struggle getting from the Minneapolis airport to this hotel. It took two full days and much waiting in many lines. And we're very, very tired and our feet really hurt. And we're very, very hot. We're very glad this room has air conditioning. Uh, the kids' initial impressions of Paris are not very positive. Um, they're struck by how many people smoke here. It's also very, very dirty. And there is a lot of graffiti. There are a lot of pigeons. <laughs> a lot of pigeons. And we don't necessarily feel the safest. Uh, um, in one like doorway, like doorway to a bar maybe, some back door, there was a wadded up white t-shirt covered in what looked to be dried blood, like a <laughs> lot of it. Great. <laughs> so either it was dried blood or like beer or something, but it was not healthy, healthy yeah. and quite concerning actually. 
I did have a very different experience than when I was here in 1999 with my mom because when I came with my mom, we had like a private van service take us directly from the airport to our hotel, which was near Notre Dame. I don't remember the name, but I'm sorry. And that made it very easy. The kids and I went the budget route. <laughs> we, well, it, first of all, it took us two hours to get through immigration at Charles de Gaulle. That was ridiculous. And it took like five seconds to get through. Yeah, the, when he actually checked our passports, that took like five seconds. It was the line that took two hours. We took the RERB, so that's the regional train B, into Paris. The trains were very, very dirty and very, very busy. And it cost 30 something Euro, euros, 30 euros for the three of us for the RER into Paris. And then we took the B train to Châtelet Les Halles station. And then we had to change to the A train, which was literally right on the next platform. It was very easy to find. We only had to take it one stop to Gare de Lyon. And Gare de Lyon is not far from here, but we were so exhausted and so hot. And we had a lot of trouble finding this place because the streets are all zigzaggy like they are in Europe, in the old parts of cities. <laughs> so anyway, I would recommend this hotel as of first viewing, but this is true of most hotels in big cities in Europe. The rooms are very, very small, unless oh. it's a... Yeah, unless it's a modern, newly built hotel. But the staff here is very, very nice. And the lobby area is lovely. And they do offer breakfast here, but it's an extra charge, and I didn't pay for that. I don't know what the area around here is really like yet, because all we were doing was wandering around, dragging our suitcases, trying to find the hotel. So anyway, there you go. That was our room here. Let me know your thoughts. Leave any questions in the comments below, and I will answer those. Here's our little tiny door. And here's the hallway, here's the stairs. And here's Ben standing in the hallway. Ben, show us the elevator. Okay, I'm gonna have to take the elevator because I can't do it downstairs. Down You're going the elevator with me? Yeah. Okay. Dude, I don't have the energy. I haven't eaten for 24 hours. <laughs> Here it comes. Here comes Megan. Did you grab the key? Okay, can you, yeah, you keep that one. Okay. Here's the elevator. It's kind of light, man. Go in first, buddy. Okay, you gonna take the stairs? Yeah, why are these stairs? I don't know. They're right there. Okay, so we come in. As you can see. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. I think it's close. Exactly. That means first, no, that means first floor. Oh, I can push, okay. Oh, no, first floor is, that's right. This is Europe. That was another. Did they? I thought they were small. Here we go. We, we got off at, at one. <laughs> I was standing there. Okay, so here's the lobby. There's the, where they put our bags. Let's see, they lock them. They have the New York Times. <laughs> In English. There's games. Oh, are they? So. This is where you come down the stairs. It's very nice. And then there's the breakfast room back there. Bon, bon matin. Thank you so much for watching. If you appreciated or enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. Have a great day, safe travels.